wearing the navy blue trunks with red trim. He stands five feet, 11 inches tall. He weighed at 12 stone, five ounces. He comes to us with a professional record of nine victories versus three defeats and two drums. And he fights out of Basel, Switzerland by way of Portugal, introducing El Fenomeno Celso Neves. And his opponent fighting out of the red corner, wearing the red trunks with white trim. He stands six feet, three inches tall. He weighed at 11 stone, 13 pounds. He comes to us with a perfect, undefeated record of 10 victories, no defeats, with eight of those wins coming by way of knockout. And he fights out of Barnsley, South Yorkshire, England, introducing the current reigning Central Area Super Middleweight Champion. Ladies and gentlemen, here's Callum Simpson! What an atmosphere, what a reaction to the introduction of Callum Simpson. Originally, when he thought he was boxing, he thought that Barnsley would be playing Ipswich, but because of the international break, that game is postponed. And he thought that he would sell 350 tickets. I'm sure there are a lot more in here now. Now he has to do, do his bit, Matt Macklin, because he's got the big build up. It's down to him. Yeah, exactly. He's stepping out of the small hall boxing circuit into the, the television, big time boxing circuit here, live on Sky Sports, opening up the broadcast and in with an opponent who's got a winning record on his own ambitions himself and he's started sharp here already, getting that jab out, hooking up it, putting combinations together. Very good, fast start here from him. Yeah, to be expected, Callum Simpson really pouring it on in the early stages here. Oh, big right hand catches. Let's just take a look at Neves. He takes a few steps towards Darren Sargentson. Has the head cleared. Brutally stung early. Just tries to answer back with a right hand of his own, but it's a dream start for the Barnsley man. Darren Sargentson looking on. Neves throws a right hand, needed to as well. Well, it's a torrid start for Celso Neves. Simpson is a good finisher, even at a lower level. Eight knockouts in ten wins. Put up a pop. That was a nice shot there. That just wants to be careful here, Simpson, that he doesn't you know, get too excited and punch himself out here, hitting arms and gloves, because of these shots are going through. He's got up a pop. He looks so heavy-handed, Matt. Every shot has serious, spiteful, bad intentions. Yeah, it was a short right hand that caused the knockdown. He just shoved him off and created a little bit of roof. And it was a short right hook, I believe, which caused the knockdown. Just maybe he needs to just settle down here now a little bit. Neves has, looks like he's weathered the early onslaught, so maybe he just wants to get back behind the jab here now, Simpson. That's good left hand work, hooking off the jab, head. Buddy, then switching the left up the through the middle. Yeah, naturally long levers, and Simpson is using them to terrific effect. Lovely right uppercut from Simpson. And Neves, well, it's a torrid, torrid opening round for the visitor. You can't blame him for holding on, but this is where he was caught. For the experience that he's had, he just got caught daydreaming, really. Callum yeah. Simpson just created that space and landed the right hand, and again, the right hand lands. Yeah, it was caught a little bit cold. 
I think Simpson just shoved him off him, created that bit of room, then chopped in the right hook, which, which knocked him down. And then I think after that, he was still a little bit shell shocked. But I think he's done the right thing now, Simpson, settled down. He's got back behind the jab. But if there were any nerves, they evaporated almost immediately. Let's have a look at this shot. Yeah, you just see him here taking a little half step back, creating a bit of room, and then chopped over a right hook. But it was quite probably up around the temple area. Yeah, his legs. Yeah, his legs betrayed him and he went down. You see him, yeah, just create that bit of room, chopped it over. Yeah, you can see referee Darren Sanderson just on the edge of the shot there. He was just saying stop holding, he didn't, he didn't call break, he didn't say stop boxing. Yeah, I think I caught him up around the temple as well, which would be very decent, disorientating and uh, you know, down to the canvas there, probably just get, a, get out of the way of him. Probably saved him as well. Well, talk about living up to the reputation of a big puncher. And what's the confusion here? No gum shield for Celso Neves. He'll need that, you would think. Because that was a dominant, brutal first three minutes for Callum Simpson on his boxer and Sky Sports debut. I mean, it couldn't have gone any better. Yeah, dream start. You know, won the first round of the 10-8 round as well. Oh, good left hook there. Nice long left hook counter as Neves. He's got to be careful, Neves. He's got to fall short with those right-hand leads or get clipped with that left hook, as he did then. Yeah, Neves just fell short with his own work, and Simpson is making him pay, and there's the razzmatazz. He's enjoying himself. You can see the physical advantages of Callum Simpson. He's, he's a ginormous super middleweight. That was a good uppercut. Just nice jab, left hook, right uppercut combination. Yeah, Neves on this occasion takes it well. But then almost a carbon copy of what happened in the first round, Simpson just creates half a yard of space and drives in the right hand. Neves has not learned his lesson in that respect. Neves just trying to get his own right hand off. Misses on this occasion. He's looking for the right hand, Matt Neves, but he's he's not quite coming over the left shoulder of Simpson, who's got his chin tucked in nicely behind it. Yeah, he's ducking down, Simpson, just getting out the way of that right hand. Sometimes his chin's a little bit, or he looks a bit upright, uh, Simpson, but he's, he's staying, at least he's tucking the chin under the shoulder. Oh, sorry, behind the shoulder. He's bullying Neves at the moment, though, physically, especially when they come together. And the confidence, we're surging through the Barnsley man, hands down by his sides. He trusts his own chin. I mean, he went over to Canada and did plenty of rounds with Arta Beterbiev. And here he is on the front foot, trying to punch through Celso Neves in the early stages of this eight-rounder here in Manchester. Neves has got three losses, but he's only been stopped once, and that was by Podrag McCrory. And that was a fight that Neves was having a little bit of success, but McCrory is a really spiteful puncher himself and got the job done in sensational style. But Neves not deterred. He is trying to at least try to fight fire with fire here. Yeah, Neves always looking to try and fire back, but I think the quality shots are coming from Simpson. The uppercuts are pretty vicious. And they seem to have a real effect on Neves every time they land as the pair go nose to nose. Well, here is the main man, Lawrence Acoli, back on Sky Sports. Well, he's had some frustration outside of the ring, but he's back under the bright lights, defending his world title against mandatory challenger David Light. That's coming up later, and he cuts a really relaxed figure, does Acoli, as he has all week. So many big fights on the horizon in this cruiserweight division. He must 
avoid any hiccups tonight against David Light. Seconds out. Round three. Round three of this super middleweight contest. Callum Simpson's in the red with the white trim. Celso Neves is in the blue, white and red. And a shout out to Luis van Poch Pucci taking part in his 170th contest, his final contest tonight. The reason I bring him up, it's not a good reason. The punching power, actually, Callum Simpson is one of only a few men to stop Pucci. That's a mark of how he uh, heavy-handed Simpson is, but a shout-out to Pucci. What a serviceman he has been to British boxing. We wish him all the best in his final professional contest tonight. Yeah, it looks to me um, Simpson's one of these wildly strong guys, you know, tall and, and, and thin, but deceptively strong and probably heavy-handed too. Neves letting his own punches go, cuts. eats a huge uppercut there from Simpson. And as Neves gets his own work off, it's creating opportunities for Simpson, who's stalking at range, good work with the left hand, goes body and head, the Barnsley man. Yeah, good variety there with the left hand, hooking off the jab, going downstairs with it, switching it up the middle as well. Just injects a bit of hand speed as well. But Neves is there, he's still letting his own hands go, just trying to get a foothold in this fight. Oh, oh, big he goes. Huge right hand from Simpson! That could be a finisher! Neves was looking to get his own right hand off. He bravely gets to his feet, but that's all she wrote. Callum Simpson, now you know! That was a big shot. Nailed him with the right hand, went down heavy. Neves didn't think he was going to get up. He got up kind of on eight times. But the referee looked in his eyes and thought, no. You're in no position to continue. Impressive. Impressive performance there from Simpson. He looked, you know, started quickly. Looked dangerous, very heavy-handed. Uh, good variety as well. Hooking off the jab, going downstairs with it. Then switching it up the middle. Uh, good repertoire punching. Yeah, impressive. Callum Simpson said all week, give me the platform, give me the backing, and I will show you exactly what I can do. And that was explosive, destructive from Callum Simpson. Neves not happy about it, but he did get to his feet, but Darren Sargenson looked into his eyes and said, no, enough is enough. There is Simpson with Ben Shalom, who is positively delighted to get his man signed under the boxer banner. And he shifted some tickets tonight, Callum Simpson, and they really will be going home happy. Let's have a look, Matt. Yeah, he's the right hand, he just bowls it over, low, low, right hook, you know, bang on the chin. Beat Neves to the punch. Yeah, Neves was throwing the right hand himself, which kind of added to the momentum of the shot, you see him here, he goes for his right hook here, Neves. Boom. Just hits him right in the mouth. That is an absolute peach of a right hand from Callum Simpson. It's amazing that Neves made it to his feet. Yeah, he went down heavy there, didn't think he was going to get up at all, but he did make it to his feet, but I think he was on like nine, and the referee was about to wave it off, Got kind of paused for a second, looked in his eyes, I thought, no, you're, you're not you're not ready to continue. He has only been stopped the once. So that punching power is legit from Callum Simpson. Well, let's get confirmation of the result. I'll hand you over to Master of Ceremonies, Big Mo. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Darren Sargentson calls a stop to this contest. At 1 minute, 36 seconds of round number three, declaring your winner by...